Hey y'all, Paul Wooten here, coming to you with another mailbox find from my buddy uh, Doug Storhoff and his uh, girl C. Um, seems like our packages are passing each other in the mail. Um, they just got a big box from me a couple days ago. Go check out their channel, it's Doug Storhoff. He's only got one video right now, but y'all show him some love and check out his stuff. The one video he has is what I sent him. Um, some of it was broke. Some of it was purchased. He's got another box that we're building. It's going to head his way too, but he never um, ceases to amaze me um, sending me another box that's got in the mail. Um, I've just cut the tape only. Uh, his name's D. Storhoff. And it's a medium flat rate box. I think this one's maybe been across the United States a few times. No, I didn't send it to him, but it's uh, recycling, y'all. Recycling. So we're going to dig into this box and just see what they sent me. Because I have no clue. He showed me one van. I know of a um, Dodge van that he said was in there. And that was, that's all I know. He showed me a picture of it. He said it was coming my way. So this box was bigger than that one van. So. Alright, well, it's packed well. Alright, let's see what we got here. Nice. We got a... Johnny Lightning van. I think it's one of the uh, Hitchin Joes. I believe the Hitch may have been gone, but that's good with me. It's going into my van collection. Love it. Don't have it. I need to take it out of one flat rate box and put it into another. That way, oh, this may be the one he sent me the last time. Yep. Yep. Different box. I'm going to put it back in. <laughs> anyway, let's go. Oh, nice. We got the uh, Cadillac 1. The big old limo. Pretty sweet. Let's open that bad boy up. Pretty cool. Need some new wheels. You know, even the short period of time that it was in its package is brand new and it's got rub marks on it already. Oh, yeah. Homer. Pretty cool. Oh yeah, y'all, y'all hang tight, y'all hang. I bet it's better than me. I ain't got no pause button on this thing. I may have, but I didn't realize back in the day, um, Johnny Lightning actually made one of the Homer, um, uh, one of the Simpson vehicles, and this is the uh, wagon that they made. Couldn't remember where I put it, but uh, it's got a luggage rack on top, so I can get two goes of this thing here, man. You got the hum uh, Homer Simpson vehicle somewhere. And then the wagon, of course, you know, I gotta have a wagon. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna display all that stuff together. But, uh, ooh, nice. This is, uh, definitely a, um, wheel swap candidate. You guys have had this for a while. Haven't been able to, uh, do much hunting lately. A few things here and there, but, uh, What's that? Let's see what else we got. Oh, yeah. Let's see. This must have been from a 10 pack or something. I don't have this mini here. Campbell's Garage. Now, I don't believe that's like, that's not Campbell's suit, but it's, it's still awesome. Ooh, yeah. Jeep. Willie's Jeep. Very nice. Oh, there, there we go. I want to dig a little bit deeper. We got a. Uh, we got so we got that Homer. We got that one. We got this one. Hot Wheels. And then we got the Johnny Lightning wagon. Ain't that cool? Sweet. All right. Oh yeah, that looks like somebody took a big old, uh, took a big bite out of that one. 
Nice. I needed that one with the rotor wheels on. The one that I had, I immediately got it. I threw some real riders on it. The only thing that bugs I, I don't like about this van is the open hood. Now, if you buy the plastic one, it has it closed. I mean, the roof on, excuse me, not hood. Oh, nice. Nice. Look at that. Mothers. Mothers, mothers. And yes, I open everything up. I do, that's just what I do. Nice. This is a uh, Shelby American 50 years, 1962 to 2012 Shelby collector collectibles. It's a uh, raw. But it's not only being raw, but it's going to be fair. It's going to be out in the wild here. Let them breathe. This. Lamar's got his uh, free the peace. I got let them breathe or let it breathe, and uh, I'll have to dig into that further because it's got a war going around it. But that is a sweet piece right there, y'all. Nice. Uh, I guess this is uh, I don't know how you do all that. It's got a code on it, right? Who cares? When you open it, you need to... Oh, nice. Well, drop top Corvette. That's sweet. Thank you so much, dude. That's pretty cool. I do like the when this came out. For some reason, it just always looked pretty cool. That was a series that wasn't worth a flip. But All right, here's a uh, another Shelby collectible. This is put out by... Jamming in products. Another uh, Cobra. I do like Cobras. The blister is already warning. He's already. And that's a cute little piece right there. Plastic wheels. Pretty cool. Baja breaker. Color changer. That one was that. They're going to come open. And uh, it, uh, of course, changes colors. Oh, yeah, GT40. Nice. Either a Maisto or some type of off brand. Who cares? Feels good with that little Cobra. Pretty sweet. Same scale. Oh, nice. I don't have this van. I don't have this, uh, this van, the Wi Fi. And, uh, you could win a family adventure. I'll just skip the family adventure. Speaking of family adventures, the, uh, National Lampoon's, uh, wagon's gonna be out before long in, uh, Johnny Lightning. Looking forward to that, that dude. Be the first wagon that Johnny, not Johnny Lightning, excuse me, but I got green lights doing the National Lampoon's um, family truckster. That is awesome. Been waiting for a wagon from Green Light for a long time. Oh well, I guess this is a treasure hunt. The Sky Show treasure hunt. Give me a guy. Oh, look at the symbol. This is a treasure hunt car, and it's hard to find and highly collectible. That is pretty cool. It's one of those jet engines on it. That's pretty sweet. Toyota Tacoma. Tacoma. When these come out, any customizers out there, when these come out, if you guys ever use like. Uh, These um, individual smaller blisters. These ones right here were, were done by uh, Protectopack because us customizers like these smaller ones. And you can put a card in there of a, your own. And you can put the car in here. And the good thing about this right here, you can put this insert inside with that and then close it. 
just gives it a little bit of protection, which is still plastic behind it, but if it has the card in it, it's going to rub on that paper. But um, There's that style from Protector Pack, and then there's another style that I've been using for a long time. Sorry, I'm off track, but guess what? Oh, uh, Angel knows how I go from one thing to the next. But you can, uh, these ones here, they fold in two. And they're really cool. You can stick a card in there also, put your custom card in it. And, uh, it moves a little, but not a ton. But anyway, that's just a tip for the customizers out there that like to repackage. I'm not a fan of putting it back in its original package. Some people do that. Um, I'm just not one to do that, so it's all good. Um, Oh, nice. The speed box. I guess that's a treasure on it too, I think. Yep. Yeah. That's cool. Oh, yeah. The rip rod. Open it too. That's cool. That is a pretty cool model. Corvette it came back to me when it, when I first found these at the Kmart day there was one hanging on the peg and there was a gentleman that was a truck driver out of town and he said I like Corvettes that are done and I said well you know about the Corvette treasure hunt he said no I didn't know it was and I said well here you go I handed it to him so here it is back karma always comes back to me good and bad pretty sweet oh and I've already seen it Ooh, nice 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 I'm about to sneak out and uh it's a holy grail of some race. I'm gonna uh, cut I don't know how many of you guys other than me like to uh cut these pictures out. I'll cut that truck out and I'll sometimes I'll cut the Hot Wheel logo out and I'll make like put a magnet on the back of it and hang it on my refrigerator. Kinda cool. Cool. I'll leave this one in there for now. The uh, 1965 uh, Ford Falcon Club wagon. Love these old wagons. It's pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. Oh, I see some. He hooked me up. All right. Nice, nice joyride. 40, 40 Ford Woody. That is pretty cool. Joey Ride, um, RC2. Get your handy dandy little knife out there. Cut that out. One thing about, about live TV is you get it. You, if you cut yourself, you, uh, that is awesome. I think the hood opens on it. I'm sure it's basically a. It is. It's a racing champions. So when was this put out? 2004. Yep. Back when they were still rolling. But that is bad. I'm liking that. I'm not a really huge fan of the, the, wood, the old, you know, the 40s. When they started doing the Woody's on, uh, on the newer cars. Oh, that's uh, Boyd Connington. Wow. Awesome. So this little card here. Yeah, I like the boy. Did you ever watch all his show? It was really, really cool. But boy, he was a hard ass. Oh, said ass on TV. Wow, dude. I saw these online and uh, didn't know what they were still coming out. The uh, 66 custom 66 GTO wagon. Oh no, it's got a bent card. But holy smokes, that's sweet. I can do my custom roundup now, I think. I uh, might have one or two more. Yep, that's a prime example of... See the blue, it's all over the card. And it's rubbed off the back. That's all. That's not a problem. The uh, 64 Chevy Nova station wagon. 
I guess I better show you. I add that to my uh, add that to my collection of station wagons, which is not a really huge collection. It's just all kinds of cool stuff. But uh, looks like that's it. Um, check them out. Doug store off. I'll actually put a link to his thing down there. He's only done one video, but I'm encouraging him to do more. And a shout out to the girl there, C. Uh, filling up another box. Got some goodies in there for you also. And make him see that would that would be cool if you cut this off right here. And then cut around the hot wheels. Well this J hook kind of messes that up, but that's still something kind of cool you can put on the refrigerator. That's pretty neat. I know I keep little things. But anyway, um, this video is 16 minutes long. Got some really cool stuff coming up. Anybody like Buddy L? Uh, Coca Cola. Siku. Got some Siku stuff coming soon. Um, some uh, Majorette stuff. Somebody email me if you're interested in Coca Cola stuff. I've got a few Coca Cola things. I'm going to use this video just a minute longer. Anybody will need one of these. The Joyride Gentle. All right. Okay. So uh, that's all for now. Another video coming later on. Been running wild. Running wild. Gotta go. Gotta go. Gotta go.